Ladies and gentlemen, it is a, for lack of better words, fan freaking tastic day. Something has happened that I have been waiting for for what seems like a bloody eternity. And, you know, considering that we only have so and so little time on this mortal coil, I'd say more than a month is quite comparable. At least when you're waiting for magic, right? I mean, I ordered something and it was. It was supposed to be a treat for me because I'd gone through some pretty rough stuff, sh um, and and the the estimate that I got for the delivery was, oh, well, it's gonna be there within either a few weeks or a month or so, and I was like, all right, all right, where does it ship from? It's it's from Germany, right? It's our neighbor country. How how hard can that be? And uh, time moved on and then I got all the updates and whatnot and a week later it said that it was within the destination country and I was like yes all right a few days it's probably all it's gonna take now then I waited a few days nothing happened and then I got a message where it says like, ah, unsuccessful delivery attempt it will now be returned to the uh, to the um, return to sender and I freaked out and I called all the uh, different postal services and they told me that there had been some sort of mix up with the address and uh, they couldn't deliver it. So fuck me. <laughs> and uh, it took forever to get through customs both back and forth uh, and then I finally got through to the sender and they told me that when they'd get it they'd send it back and then it had to go through the fucking customs again. And so finally today, about three weeks after I first thought, wow, I'm going to get it now, I finally got it. And what is it that I got, you ask? Well, now that I've been rambling for a full two, three, four minutes, uh, okay, two minutes, but still, hey, what is it you asked? Well, it's Modern Freaking Horizons. I was so stoked when they started spoiling this stuff and I was amazed and I just wanted all the cards and then I saw the price and I was like, I also want to eat this month. Um, but I've come into just a bit of an allowance and I thought, why not treat myself? And uh, in the process, why not treat uh, the rest of you buggards? Because uh, I sure as hell love watching people crack obscure and hard to get products and expensive products, so um, I thought you'd like it too. And uh, today I won't be tossing the cards everywhere because um, I intend to also draft this with, uh, with the wife and mama-in-law and well, whoever else would like to. To, so I'm kind of making a cube so instead of just tossing everything everywhere in those piles of oh I like this oh I hate this not that I think I'd hate much in this uh, I'll be sorting them in my trusty old um, ultra pro sorting tray so that afterwards I can sleeve up all the uh, the different piles and uh, we can have some more fun with them of course I'll know what's in there but you know people who make cubes know what's in there anyway but I thought that that would just be the best because this this set is just so full of all sorts of cool things and I mean I don't even need to tell you guys what I'm hoping for but I'm gonna say it anyway god damn it I hope I open Ursa or or Renin 6 god damn it that would be so flippin cool well and failing that I would love uh, this little lady Sarah it's beautiful card and uh, well really any of the awesome cards in there mm, that is oh that's beautiful golden beauty right there oh a eula i'm s if i get a eula i will be making bear force one there is no way around that that is uh, that's just how it's gonna be uh out to the side with you guys so we have a bit of room to gas him um and uh let's kick things up i uh, hope you all are having a great day my day certainly just got a whole lot better when i was told that this was finally waiting for me go nappen someday i believe people will you know actually make more goats uh that would be nice until then this is just a good old-fashioned cool card uh with great art Rain Revelation, I love the card. Rhyme Tender. Oh yes, that's right, there's snow in this business. Did I just, <laughs> I just, 
knocked a bunch of boosters onto the floor. Better get those so I don't forget them. That would be, um, that would be sad. Getting to the end of the video and I'm a few boosters short. That would not be fun. Anyways, just putting them differently so that they don't fall off to the side. There we are. I am back in the Kraken game. Oh yes, snow, as I was saying. I'm so hoping for a bunch of cool snow cars, especially the, uh, the crabs. Now that they've started uh, with the Sandy Car spoilers, I am over the moon about a new Hedron Crab-esque kind of guy. I am so making six crabs, or well, no, uh, 12 crabs is what it's gonna be. Uh huh. Uh, good old Vishino, that's cool. Mob. Oh, fucking. Uh, mm, I was so stoked when they made all those new ninjas, and that one just. It just oozes character concept, doesn't it? I, I want to make that. I want to make that. Oh, it's a tiny, tiny, tiny angel that can still kill a commoner. Oh, it's so cute and it's so cool and I really hope that one day we'll go to Segovia. That would be that would be fun. That would be so fun. It's oh it's beautiful. It's absolutely beautiful. Yes. More more aristocrat nonsense and oh fucking love the art. And it's Jesper Icing. It's Jesper fucking Icing. I love that guy. He is an inspiration to me. Firebolt. Rod Widow Pack. Best thing to happen to Spider Tribal in a long time. Ooh, I honestly don't remember this card. In the beginning of your key, target creature. <laughs> oh, yes. And a snow covered plains. That's beautiful. Ooh, and an art card. Ooh, that's pretty. And a foil construct. That's lovely. That gets its own pretty little pile over here. And we're on to the next booster. Oh, I, I don't want to take my sweet, sweet, sweet time with this. So if you're one of those people who watch booster crackings and just sit there yelling at them to go faster until they get to the rares, you can fuck right off. This is not going to be one of those times. This I've, I've, I plan to sit here for the next hour or so. Uh, and you know, once this is uploaded, you can probably see how long it's gonna go. So, hey, big surprise! Anyways, Elvish Fury, cool. Ah, Minotaur. Ah, love Manifest. I, I so hope we're going back to Takia someday to get some more Manifest and some more Morph. I happen to like Morph. Deal with it. Oh, I love all these uh, these throwbacks. It looks so cool. Astrolobe. I am. I am shaking with excitement here. It's, uh, I hope I'm not shaking off the camera, but uh, you know, if, if I am, then uh, shake along with me. Azra's. Azra's is so cool. Hoping for a battle bond too. Mm -hmm. Regrowth. Good old fashioned stuffy. Uh, ooh, cycling. <laughs> I love these guys. I love, I love the throwbacks, man. And now there's actually elves in the picture. Well done. Future Sight, not the best card, but uh, hey, Snow Covered Island, and an art card. That is, that is, uh, you can't see it when it's all glary. That is just so beautiful. And the shape changer we all knew we needed, instead of that god awful looking thing from uh, from Lorwyn. Uh, I am so glad we got that instead. That looks so much more cool. Spore Frog. <laughs> when you just want to piss off everyone and re keep reanimating it. Ah, uh, yes, suspend this back. Frog. And a sliver. Oh, yeah, that's right. They've got the uh, the first sliver in this. Sliver, sliver, however you want to say it. I uh, I go back and forth because I think both sound cool. And another iteration of, of, of that thing that is just... Ah, what do you do? Jeez, oh, that is a good fucking one drop. Oh, I love this. This goes in just about every single wonky uh, armory comes alive tribal decks that I've made. Scarecrows, yes. Ooh, that is that is so clever. That is so fucking clever that they implemented splice again, and it's splicer or the oh the the the, the wordplay. 
and the Lord. Yeah. Whoop! A zombie ninja. Because it doesn't get creepy enough. Ooh, and a foil talisman of curiosity. That's nice. And a lovely piece of art. And a goblin. Goody. Well, so far, nothing too exciting, but there's uh, plenty of boosters left to go. And I, I'm still fucking shaking. I've, oh, I've been, this, this, I've been penned up for a fucking month. I've been, I don't know, I mean, I don't use my balls for this, so I'm not really blue ball. I'm, I guess I'm blue fingered. Is that a, that sounds almost as dirty, doesn't it? Lava dart. I love this. I mean, it's a fucking throwback to, uh, what was it, Future Sight or was it, uh, uh, plane shift where they did the uh, the um, the other cat from the sixth pride and we just never heard of that pride again oh that is such an olive ball uh, what the hell do you do uh, you just cut a card you do all right that is that is pretty good all tight claws yes <laughs> this looks so dumb Spectres in general and Arkans are such a cool, menacing thing, but this, this is dumb. He's riding a, I don't know what that is, a bloke fly. Ninjas. And more exploit. Love it. Shenanigans. Oh yes, I was hoping for this. I got so excited when I saw Green Freakman Overload. This is, this is gonna go crazy. This is, I'm gonna do stupid things with this. And a Crip Rat in, 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 in an updated art. I gotta say, I love the old art better, but this... Oh wait, I don't... Don't quote me on that. <laughs> All of a sudden I can't remember if, if the cards that I have from the original set actually have a different art. I'm not that big on it. Don't, 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 don't bother me. Don't, don't get into it. Twisted Reflection. Oh, Silent Clearing. Someone might argue that this is good. I, uh, I'd, I'd rather have something else. Snow cover swamp. <laughs> Take a gander. At, there we are. Take a gander at that foil fucking altar of dementia. That is beautiful. And speaking of beautiful, that is one piece of art. Damn. Yeah. All right. All right. Things are getting. A little spicy. I am thoroughly, thoroughly enjoying this. Still shaking, by the way. Um, sorry if I'm shaking you guys up. Moraza Behemoth. Uh, yeah, so an 8 8 with trample for 6 if you got a land in your graveyard. It shouldn't be that hard. Regular cohort is awesome. Tornado. Yeah, cool enough. Here's the flame. That's gotta hurt. Oh, I fucking I love this. It turns into a dinosaur, and it's a golden statue that barves up tar. That's bubbling, by the way. It's it's boiling tar, I guess. It's so fucking metal. Uh, reprobation and a bird wizard. Uh huh. Mind rake. I I I I love that. I love that. Uh huh. Yeah, choking tethers. Oh, I hope I get a bunch of these. This, this, oh, I, f I love this design and I so want to play a 2 2 golem for one mana. I would love to do that. Another sliver and another sliver and a prismatic vista. I believe this is one of the most sought after cards. I mean, it was good enough that they want to do an expedition for it in Sendigar Rising, so that's good, right? Snow covered plains and, ooh, endling art card. That is. That is some pretty stuff. All right, all right, no mythics yet. So uh, I believe uh, the statistics say that I can expect about three of them. So I am very excited. And so far the rares are pretty good. Magmatic, <laughs> I was about to say stink hole. That is, um, yeah, chilly Tuesday. Uh, Elky boy, shelter, I, I love it. It's. Great art, and the effect is great, and it's going straight in my uh, in my feather deck if it's not already in there. Uh, lovely spider and a dragon heart. That's cool. Gilded light. Oof, it looks so cool, and that 
I want to go back to Phyrexia so bad. I mean, I, I will not complain about us going back to Innistrad and Kaldheim and whatever else. But god damn it, they can't keep teasing the return to Phyrexia like that. They, 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 they just can't. I mean, fucking Karn said that he was going there next. Why can't we go there? I want to see my man cough. Goblin Matron. Oh, I remember back in the day when this hadn't been reprinted and I had to shell out some uh, some considerable dough for it. Love the new art. Again, Jesper Ising, you are the man. I, I love you, dude. I love you. You are an inspiration. A cultivator? That's cool. Battle Screech with new art. Yes, please. Collected Conjuring. I've, I've heard a lot of bad talk about this, but honestly, I'm excited to try and use this for something cool. Snow-covered swamp and uh, savage swipe. If anything, if, if I was a if I was a superstitious man, I'd say that this bodes well for uh, for possibly drawing uh, uh, pulling a Eula. Lovely art and a soldier. Cool, cool, cool. What else can we pull? Hoping so fucking much for Ren and Six. It would just be. Bomb in my in my wind grace deck. Of course, anyone would would put it in there, but I want to do it too. And I just don't have the uh, the extra cash laying about for that. Well, I guess I bought this. I could have bought a Renin Six, but fuck it. I, I I'd rather want to do the lottery and share this whole opening with you guys. I I love this little guy. He is so cool, and I bet you he didn't kill that dragon on his own. I bet you there was people along. He just sort of photo bombed it. Prohibit and return to ex from extinction. Yes, please. Let's go in angel. Ooh, good fortune unicorn. Such a good card. Forgotten cave. Face of divinity. Ah, uh, nice, nice. That is that is good. Cabal therapist. I believe alongside of Sarah, this was the first card that was spoiled for this. I got really excited, especially because I freaking love horrors. Snow-covered island and a beautiful little piece of art for uh, what was it, the, uh, the swampy clearing or whatever it was. Uh, I don't know. Doesn't matter. What matters is that we get to Kraken. Come here. Oh, yes. Straightful Gumbra. Anything that'll let me bulk up on deal Damage with your toughness effects is good in my book. Man of War, Goblin War Party, more things that can get me. Uh, goblin tokens on a sorcery on instant is always good in my book. It's definitely good for, uh, for Walt the Raid Mother. Oh, it's beautiful, simply beautiful. Winding Way, I love the art. I freaking love it. Chiller Pillar. Ah, the puns, the puns are real. I haven't gotten any of the Cancrixes yet. I'm really wanting a place out of those. Come on, guys, it's a common, shouldn't be that hard. Musawa's charm, he is a charming fella. Look at that, that is, that is roguish charm right there. Stream of thought, yeah. Cunning evasion, that's cool. Wolf blossoms, it's also cool. Fester of fool, a feaster of fools. That is, it's just a brilliant, Brilliant synergy between Convoke and, and, and Devour. It's it's a flavor of freaking win. <laughs> a sword! Not the sword I wanted, but the sword I the sword I deserve, I guess. It's still it's one of the swords and it's it's good. It is a good card. I am definitely happy that I got it. Beautiful art and a really, really freaking weird illusion, but I guess that is the the whole idea with illusions, isn't it? It's it's supposed to be uh, supposed to be overwhelming for the senses. All right, what do we have here? Good old Norin, who hates me. Uh, I hate you too, Norin. I really do. No, I I, I, I think he's great. Lance Sliver, quick for the Cyclops. Elk, Winter's Rest, Goat Nab. Love it. I absolutely love it for when you can't get enough of Changeling. That ball of Edict, Phantasmal Form, Mongoose! <laughs> yes, another Talisman! I, I want as many of these as I can possibly get. I love them dearly. Ah, all right, cool. 
Cool. Ooh, Frostwork Bastion. I was hoping for this. I I have a deck that is, uh, well, it's it, there's many iterations of it, really, but the, the idea is that it's the architecture that attacks you. So golems that come to life and... Uh, and uh, I uh, draw bridges and towers waking up. Deep Forest Hermit. That's pretty cool. That's pretty cool. Squirrels are cool. And squirrels are slowly making their way in. Beautiful, beautiful art. I really hope that I draw the Skelemental. Skelemental, I believe it's called. Who knows? I certainly don't. I don't know why I'm making this voice. Sorry about that, I am just so excited. Still shaking, by the way, and sorry if I shake up the camera. Soul Strike, Elvish Fury, oh, it's freaking beautiful. More goblins, Rhyme Tender, so far not that many snow things, you know, except for the lands, and I love them. Stirring Address, Silver Scavenger, Smoke Shroud, ooh, that guy again, I love him, and Shenanigans, Sadistic Obsession. Put a minus counter. Ooh, goody. I love me some minus counters. Alpine Guide. Such a weird card, but I think it's cool what they try to do with it. And Infiltrator and Debt of Winter. All right. I'm definitely going to do something with it. Snowland. And Ooh, wow, that is, that is gorgeous. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. And then, what's his face? Omnath, the locust of rage, just burst through the wall. There we are. Drew it. Dot. Oh, I was hoping to get some more of this. I always am on the lookout for more cheap flickers. There we go. A bear. All right. All right. We've we've got some good bear stuff. We just need the uh, the, the mother of them all. Oh, I fucking love this. And I love the throwback to... Uh, Oh, uh, what was it called? It was called um, Lingering Outcast or something, or uh, Lingering Spirit. Anyways, it's so beautiful, it's so cool, and I love that they just slapped Changeling on there and was like, good to go. Yes! Weather of the, weather of the storm! Going straight in my Calamax deck. It's been yearning for that secluded step. And more squirrels, and throws of chaos, and Aria of Flame. It's one that each opponent gains 10 life, and then when I cast an instant sorcery, it gets a verse counter, and... <sighs> I think I have a Chandra deck, and Chandra needs to learn how to sing now. <laughs> oh, that is gorgeous. That is a gorgeous piece of art right there. Righty then. Okay, okay. Mm. See what else we can pull. So far we are one mythic in and while it's cool it's certainly not the best thing we could get but uh, I ain't complaining. Well maybe a little but I mean it's too early to really complain because there's so many so many cool things that I can still pull. Ooh, rebuild. That's cool. Valen Changeling. Ch -ch 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 Changeling. I love it. I freaking love it. And the Changeling there gets <sighs> It's just a two mana three three with double strike. Glacial revelation. What do you do? Subject card. You may put in a number of snow permanents from among them into your hand. <laughs> I'm gonna do broken things with this. <gasps> oh! <laughs> I just I saw the uh, I saw the legendary blue flame. I was like, is he is he here? But this. Uh, not as good, but I am definitely loving this. Oh god damn it, this is so cool. Snow covered swamp and another one of those and a full squirrel. <laughs> yeah. Alright, this this is looking out to be pretty darn cool. I mean that uh that uh twelve twelve crabs deck, apart from the other eight crabs, everything in there I plan for to be snow, so uh, I'm definitely getting a Merit Lodge. Okay, boy, girl, who knows? Doesn't want to be defined like that. Defi uh, doesn't want to be defiled like that either. Uh, Goblin Champion, Recruit, <laughs> Rogue, Possibilities, Cave, cave of Temptation, that's, that's good. I wanted that on Earth. Oh, yes, I kite. Smiting Helix. Love it. 
I love it. It it's 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 lightning helix, you know, but also in black. And then it's only when you flashback it, but that it's an actual lightning helix. But it, it, you get it, you get it. It, it, it goes in modern decks. Ooh, Soul Herder! I was hoping for this. I've, boy, I've got some spirit decks and some flicker decks that you fit right into. Fact or fiction? Echo of Eons. All right. Really not the mythic I was hoping for, but hey, it's a it's a good card. Definitely a good card. Ah oh, man, just just give me one of the really really good chases. Give me Ursa. Give me give me give me six. Give me Sarah even. Oh, come on, that is beautiful Minotaur right there. Beautiful. I I thought so. I thought as much. Jesper, Jesper, you are my hero for numerous numerous reasons. Especially for uh, for kicking ass in, uh, not especially, but also for kicking ass in. Uh, ooh, that's a that's a bit of a. I don't know if you guys can see the uh, the line right there. Oh. Anyways, uh, he kicked some serious ass in uh, in uh, in game nights the other day. Uh, Love watching that. Another flicker. Ah, oh, it's a cute little lizard. And that's also a lizard, but uh, not as cute. And not actually a lizard, but you know, it's a lizard folk. The file and the goblin and gilded light. <laughs> Snuff. Uh, ransack the lab. Goblin or a flam. Or a flamme? Doesn't matter. It's good. It's real good. Baron Moor. Lesser Mastical. Fiery Islet. Islet? I don't know. Some might argue that this is good. I kind of feel like this is a waste of my time and my money, but uh, I'm not going to complain that much. Cool, cool vampire and uh, beautiful foil elemental. All right, all right, come on. We're, we're not even halfway through and I've spent the first 20 or so minutes just babbling. That's, uh, that's good. If anyone's still watching, uh, I hope you're uh, you're enjoying this in somewhat the same way that I am. If not, then why the hell are you sitting here? Uh, yep, yep, Tribute Mage. <laughs> oh, oh, oh. Yes, this is one that I was hoping for. Oh, yes, so many fucking Enchantress decks. And this basically goes in all of them. Snow-covered mountain and... Beautiful art of uh, of Mons. He, uh, that is beautiful. God damn it, the nose on the guy though. Ah, oh, yes, more boosters, more boosters for my hollow body. Why it's hollow, I shan't disclose. That's up to you. Sorry about that. That is that that is a weird thing to say. Uh, please don't go. <laughs> I have a feeling we're about to get something cool, and then we did. But something cooler even, also cool. Uh, Shadow Assumptions, oh, that's cool. Yes, Talisman, and another Talisman. And Crashing, f what the hell is this? Okay, cool. That is pretty good. That is pretty flippin' good. And we've got to foil something. All right, first sphere, gonna taunt me again with not going directly to New Phyrexia. I, I appreciate the foil. Um, let's see what else we can crack. Did I just? Yeah, okay. There we go. Changeling and a cure lizard wizard. It would be cool with the lizard wizard. I mean, we already got the one from uh, from Return to Ravnica or Return to Return to. You you get the you get the picture. Alliances or whatever it was. Sir and Tusker and De and the Rogue and finally one of them. I was I had forgotten that this was something that I was hoping for at this point. You're a common. How many? I, I guess there's a lot of comments in here. But come on, I want a playset. I want a playset. Ooh, Itchings of the Chosen. Good card. Throat Seeker is also good. Exclude and Plague Engineer. Okay, for when you really want to bother someone uh, and make their tribal deck inefficient. Beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. 
love that they gave bolster to slivers because you know they certainly need to bulk up they they need all the help they can get uh, i not gonna lie if i do pull uh the uh, the first sliver i am so making a a sliver deck that's uh, that's for sure it's, it's such a good card i'll just have to uh, to get over my uh my grudges <laughs> <laughs> fucking thing ah oh, so dumb geomancer's gambit every time i see this art i want to make an earthbender that is that is that is that is goals. Uh, Watcher for tomorrow, dismantling blow, writer guy, force of despair. Sure. All right. Fair enough. Uh, I, I, I bet someone thinks it's good. I'm I'm not that excited. Uh, <laughs> roguish charm in full art glory, and a shiny elephant. Didn't know we were playing Pokemon. Again, sorry about the uh, the dad jokes. We uh, we just got a new cat, and he is freaking adorable. And I am getting some serious, serious dad issue vibe, whatever you call it. Another Umbra. It's lovely. Uh, I th I think I said something about not speeding through things, but you know, once you've seen them a few times, you just want to get to the really good stuff. Ah. Oh. Cool, cool thing. I love, I love, I love the flavor of, of these changelings. It's so cool. Everdream. Nice. Woo. Whip Weaver changeling. Nice. Oh, I've, mm. my, my wife, one of her favorite Boros cards is the uh, is Sky Knight Legionnaire. She, I, she has an entire page in her collector's folder just filled up with different artworks of Sky Knight Legionnaire and foils and whatnot. And uh, whenever she plays with a board deck, when she plays the Sky Knight Legionnaire, she goes, Sky Knight Legionnaire! And throws it across the table. And we all have a laugh. And then I realize that I'm about to take a lot of damage continuously. And then I stop laughing. Anyways, good card for when I eventually make that. Oh yeah. Uh, for eventually when I do make a sliver deck at some point, Hogag is in this. Hogag? I don't know, Hogag. That sounds um, that sounds like a very very apt male porn star name. I suppose you could also be a a female porn star uh, that makes hoes gag. Um, anyways, <laughs> onto the cards. Let's talk about porn. Uh, yippa, yippa, and yespa, almost yippa. Bet he's been called Yebber a few times. Slaver, Fist of Flame, Possibilities, Unearthed, Phantasmal Form. Oh, it's all cute! Love it! Friggin' love it! It goes in all my zombie tribal decks. And another lovely little Slaver. And an Altar of Dementia! I will not complain. I have several decks that can benefit from this. So uh, I do not complain. And uh, Play Carrier! When you just want to rub it in that uh, that you nerfed someone's tribal deck with the actual card a few minutes ago. There we go. Speaking of, it's a few minutes since we last pulled a mythic. Could this be now? And could it be something worthwhile? Good map. <laughs> oh, these, oh, these are also good cards and I have so many things I can do with them, but I really also want to Mm, get to more scale ups and grave shit. Ah, uh, what was his uh, name? Grave Digger was uh, was one of the first cards that I ever had, and I loved it so dearly. And seeing this throwback just makes me so happy. Then we'll try and Pashalik Mons. He is he's cool. He's very cool. Snow covered mountain and oh yeah, the uh, Ranger Captain or whatever his name is. I. I wouldn't mind getting him as my mythic, but I really do hope that I'm getting one of the uh, the really, really major goals. But, uh, you know, be happy with what you get. You, Some people are unlucky enough that they only get two mythics in a box, and I certainly hope that I'm not one of them. I'm not jinxing it. Cave of Temptation, yes. 
Uh, ooh, Vesper Mark! I love it. I love the little guys. Again, with the throwbacks. We growth, carrion feeder. Definitely better art than the original. And Cordial Vampire. Uh -huh. Oh, goodness. I never even knew how good that was. Hello, Mr. Weird Al. Thank you for, uh, for inviting me. Snow covered forest and beautiful, beautiful art card and a foil token. Alrighty then. We are, I'm not sure if we've moved entirely. I think we are into the second half of this, but um, things can still get very, very, very wild. Come on, Ayula, I want you so bad. I bet she's, uh, I bet she usually hears that a lot and then she goes, <laughs> which means fuck off. Yes, another kind of uh-huh. <laughs> so weird that they decided to mix it with a trilobite. But yeah, sure. Wing shards and a talisman. Okay. Okay. That's that's a mythic. And uh, it's it's uh, it's an ox. I have no idea if uh how good this is, but you know what? I mean paying zero for a tap for anything uh that I can use three turns later, that's seems pretty decent. Seems pretty decent. Snow covered and beautiful foil and <laughs> it's incredibly ugly, but uh, flavorful, I guess. All right, well, that was officially the third mythic. Um, still hoping so incredibly much for, uh, for Renin 6 or Ursa, but uh, I shan't be greedy. I am just enjoying opening these really really cool cards it's so cool that they chose to put evolve on a on a slug horror <laughs> i ought to do some cool things with this i think i could do some pretty cool things on earth yes fantasma form another crypt rats oh they crypt rats have spearheaded one of my oldest and in my opinion best decks talisman on on your Illusion. Ooh, giver of the runes. Ah, that's pretty cool. You don't have to sack her. That's pretty cool. Uh, Snow covered island. All right. And beautiful, beautiful art, by the way. Ninja. Ninja. All right. Come on. There's still a bunch of boosters left, actually. I feel like I've been cracking so much. But um, I guess it's just the anticipation set got me all riled up all right what else can we pull in here generous gifts <laughs> freaking funny it is oh, no 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 you can't have that you can have an elephant there there you go have an elephant Hey, hey, Siege, uh, Sling Gang, Lieutenant. That's good. <gasps> okay. All right, all right, all right. Fair enough, fair enough. I'm making a Sliver deck. I, yeah, all right, we're doing this. Damn. Hello. <sighs> all right, well, guess we're doing this. <laughs> yeah, yeah, you got a mythic, but you wasn't me. You can have my art though. Fuck it though. I, I got I got my fourth mythic and it was the first sliver. Nice. Alright. Alright. Well I I already do have a sliver overload from uh, from way back when I opened Scorch, so I mean I've got some uh, I've got some good fodder for it and uh, got a few other cool things. Ursus Rage. <laughs> Yes. Oh, yes. Jesus Christ, that's a big kicker cost. Um, this. This is going straight into my Obosh deck because I believe that the kicker cost, yeah, it's an additional cost that doesn't actually add to the original casting cost. Uh, so I believe this is still an uneven card, even if I pay the uh, kicker and it goes up to 12 mana that I have spent on it, because 
day. Oh, I would love to spend 12 mana to deal 20 damage. Kaya's Guile. Not a bad card. It's no covered and nice. That's two foil rares. I, I'm not gonna complain. I, I don't think I was gonna anyways, but uh, now I'm definitely not. And I just got, I just got the, uh, the kickstart, if you will, to uh, to uh, not back down from the uh, creation of a sliver deck. So uh, yeah, that's a that's a promise I made to myself, I guess. Um, yeah, Ooh, another eyesight golem. Forgotten Cave, Battle Screech, and, well, since you're making Slivers, have another good one. Thank you. And whew, that is, that is, that is some wild art. That is, god damn it. All right. All right. Well, I'm not sure what else we can expect from in here, but I mean, I guess, I guess, uh, Guess uh, everything's still pretty much open. I mean, I could get another mythic, or I could just get a whole bunch of really cool rares. Uh, yep, yep. Bastion and Nether Spirit. Uh, it's the only creature cut in your graveyard. You may. That's pretty cool. I think I could do some pretty cool things with that. Mountain and that guy and a foil spider. <laughs> Time to foil out my spider deck. Oh yeah, yeah. Ye. All right, there is one, two, three, four, five, six, uh, about seven boosters left. All, 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 all possibilities are pretty much still open. I mean, come on, cool stuff. Nice. Uh -huh, another unicorn, another sliver, uh, and force of rage. What do you even do? Uh, what? Why would I? Why would I create those on? I guess to block, but still. Oh, cool foil alpine guide. Beautiful, uh, beautiful pirate guy. All right, all right, all right. There's uh, still hope for cool things. Still hope for cool things. I've gotten a lot of cool things. I am in no place where I can. Uh, or I can complain. Yes, another Cantrix. Is that the third or is that the fourth that I got? In case, Goblin Horflam, Valen Changeling, Ravenous Giant. Ooh, Scalemental! Thank you! Beautiful art again and beautiful elemental. All right, all right, all right. This is, uh, this is pretty darn good. All right, I am still shaking. This is so dumb. Ah, uh, let's see here. Ah, oh, munitions expert. Oh yes. Ah, oh, to tie creature. Oh, this this is going in my uh, my Shatter Gang uh, brothers deck. Gracial revelation. Chosen. Oh gee, they all have exalted. You say? Damn, that's dumb. And another one of those. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. And uh, Devilish Charm again. All right, all right, all right. Definitely, uh, definitely pull some cool things. Let's just, uh, five left. Five left. Ren and Six can still be in there, but even if they aren't, I've still gotten a lot of really, really saucy stuff. Uh, come on then, come on then. What do we get? Scrapyard Recombiner. That is a lovely card, one that I do like. Oh yeah, he's in here too. Hello, Mr. Yogmoth. Or uh, should I say uh, Spice 8 Rack? If you haven't watched the video where uh, Spice 8 Rack riffs on, uh, on eugenics, go do it, man, go do it. It is, it is incredibly amazing and fun and well thought out. My biggest compliments to that guy. He is a source of inspiration and fun and all things good in life almost all things uh there we are let's see what we can get in here Ooh, definitely also going in the uh in the uh, in the 12 crabs deck conifer hollow head 
Oh, 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 no. oh, as if I didn't have enough five colored good stuff decks. Damn, Ooh, beautiful swamp and astrolabe. Astrolab, astrolabe, I, I, don't, I don't know. I don't know, don't expect me to know those things. All right, this is the third to last. Let's see what we can get. Uh, heads up, by the way, the cat is prowling on the floor below. He might just decide to uh, to make a jump for it. So uh, if he does, you'll get to say hi. And if he doesn't, uh, well, then things won't get disturbed. Hey, Hogag! Nice. Definitely going to do fun things with him. Snow cover planes and... Oh, you haven't gotten Sarah, but you will get her art piece and a beautiful beautiful ugly rhino i really do dislike that particular piece of art your but, wife uh, likes it <laughs> you you do yeah but it but <laughs> why it's i think it looks cool but with the tiny tiny uh what are those calls the uh the the, the holsters that you put your your feet in what are those called i can't remember uh the stirrups, stirrups. they make it look so silly it's like they're just dangling on the uh, on the sides of it there's not even a rider yeah because i always saw it like it like it threw the rider off yeah i guess but couldn't it also have like thrown off the saddle then it makes it look like a failed attempt at domestication i guess the, the idea is that yeah you can't domesticate it but how did you manage to make it go fight the opponent then or at least you know direct it birthing both throat seeker La Damri's call. Not a bad card at all. Not right. Bad. Not bad at all. <laughs> well, uh, did you want me to pull something awesome for you? Well, this is the last booster. If you uh, if you pull me a, a Renin Six or an uh, Ursa in here, I uh, I will be forever in your debt. Do you want to sit here? Yeah. All right. Um, just uh don't push the thing why are yeah. there cards on the floor uh because i knocked some over in the excitement okay <laughs> fair enough uh yeah I've, I've, I've knocked around the camera a few times as well i've been shaking like crazy from start to finish <laughs> all right all right Let's see if i can uh i can pull my usual tricks oh i would love so you guys Last two times we've been opening booster boxes together, she has pulled all of those awesome alternate art super foil thingy dingies. Yeah. Uh -huh. Uh -huh -huh. Nothing crazy so far. I like that guy. I like that guy. Okay, that is not bad at all. Not the, the, not the best thing, but it's not bad at all. Thank you, honey. You're welcome. And the God, nah. that just gets uglier and uglier. Nah. <laughs> it's like, nah. get rock monster, dad, do you love me now? No. <laughs> <laughs> thanks for uh, thanks for helping me, honey bunny. You're welcome. All right, well. Get rock monster. Oh, dad. And, and, and then I managed to oh, knock dad. it myself. You got out of there just fine and then I knock it. Well, uh, oh. thanks you guys for, uh, thanks you guys for tuning in. And uh, this was lovely. And uh, Goodbye. He hello, he hello, Goodbye. He <laughs> hi, Tyrion. <laughs> yeah, the cat's named Tyrion. Uh, so deal with it. We have, I have put a, uh, I've put extra locks on the bathroom door, and I've removed all the, uh, Cross the crossbows from the home. So, uh, so that's it. Uh, thanks for tuning in, and uh, well, uh, if if you're the kind of person who does that, maybe leave a like. Maybe subscribe. Who knows? I don't know what will come of that. In any case, uh, stay frosty.